So he is a talented musician and collector of instruments, and he restores them as well. Tonight, our Tar Heel travelers in Pitt County, Scott Mason meeting the Greenville Music Man. Call him a kind of musical wizard. This is uh, the only instrument in the world that you play without touching it. Slight of hand. Motion makes the music. It takes a lot of concentration. It takes a lot of soul. The faster you pedal it, the more vacuum you create, the louder it will play. Sam Harris can play almost any instrument. This is a hammer dulcimer. It's 15 strings. Sam can also fix almost any instrument. When it's finished, it will be it'll be one of, if not the largest, traveling organ in America. A carousel organ from 1925. This organ is so large and so loud that it provided the music for the whole midway. A 1960s jukebox. So you restored it? Yes, sir. He also restored this jukebox, mostly. I did not redo any of the veneer. I left it, you know, showing its age. It was an age of ingenuity. The folks that engineered these machines were brilliant. Sam is an assistant pastor in Greenville. He is also the music director for the church. Music is me. <laughs> I mean, it's just, uh, it, it's emotional. I mean, it, it, it's how I make my living. Uh, it's how I make my fun. It's what I do in my spare time. It's just music. It's just been my entire life. He is playing a theremin. You've got to be like a statue. It's an instrument from the 1920s. And I saw this and I was like, you've got to be kidding. I've often said about a player piano, leather, felt, steel, and wood. Put that as raw materials in a room and tell a group of people, this is what I want you to build. Could we do that today? They could in the old days. They did. It's preserving history. Okay. I wanted to bring it back to life. Be it an organ or a saw. And right in the middle is the sweet spot. Then it will resonate. And perhaps the example Sam has set will resonate too. These are things that I want people to come and touch and see and experience. It is my job to take what I have obtained and make it presentable to pass on to the next generation. What a guy. What's well, such an interesting story in person. Sam Harris grew up in Tennessee, started playing the piano at eight years old, lives in Greenville now. For years he's been there and sometimes will perform his many instruments in public.